Cryptocurrency is down, but a down market is when you buy. A massive bull run is coming in crypto, I think. Most will miss it. Hopefully you don't. Like this video if you too believe that a massive crypto bull run is on the horizon. Save this video to look back on over the next couple months. There are thousands and thousands of crypto projects that you could buy into. Today, I want to go over 10. This video, it's not financial advice, just opinion. You might have your own list. If you want me to include a different altcoin that you like in a future video, comment that coin below. If your comment gets enough likes, I will look into it. Bitcoin needs, needs, needs to be in your portfolio. Bitcoin represents everything that crypto was built for and everything that crypto has promised to do. More than that, institutions are waking up to this. Please buy Bitcoin before BlackRock launches their ETF. Many people are saying that Bitcoin could hit half a million dollars, even one million dollars by 2030. If it's not going to zero, it's going to a million. It's either nothing, right? If it's nothing, then it's getting scrubbed out and banned. And of course, we now know that it's not getting banned, right? There's no way that Fidelity, Citadel, BlackRock, Charles Schwab, Deutsche Bank, Credit Agricole, Banco Santander all decide they're interested in this, right? They're not endorsing a tulip bulb. Ethereum needs, needs, needs to be in your portfolio. Bitcoin and Ethereum are two of the biggest holdings in my portfolio by far. Ethereum has so much going for it but there's less education and less awareness around it compared to Bitcoin. That will change. After BlackRock launches their spot Bitcoin ETF, I believe an Ethereum spot ETF will be launched within a year. Canada has already done this. Ethereum is deflationary. I believe that Ethereum will eventually flip Bitcoin by market cap and will pump hard. You talk to people actually building in the space and they'll tell you, I do think that the Ethereum blockchain is going to have a higher market cap than Bitcoin in the next bull run. I, do. I think it has the ability to change the entire financial industry. And if you like Bitcoin, I'm, I'm not hating on it. I think Bitcoin served its purpose, but I think Ethereum has just so much utility and so much liquidity in, on the blockchain that it's unstoppable. It would have to take a very drastic problem to eliminate Ethereum out of the equation of being the number one blockchain in the world. Make sure you subscribe to our channel daily videos just like this keeping you informed on the entire cryptocurrency market if you're interested in making money in cryptocurrency subscribe to our channel daily videos i like ethereum i'm bullish on ethereum but i also want to find the next ethereum so what are the options solana is a contender solana is more battle tested today than ever before Solano's ecosystem is more built out today than ever before. Famous billionaire investor Raul Paul thinks that Solana can do what Ethereum did. Solana got battle tested like ETH did in 2018. It got battle tested last year and it survived. Not only has it survived, it thrived. Volumes have been higher than ETH. We have seen an enormous amount of developer activity. There are opportunities coming where the alts perform well. If you remember what ETH did in 2018, having been battle tested, it did 47x from the low. Solana got down to nine. So could it do 25x from here? Look, it's possible. No guarantee. I'm not even sure. And my guess is we'll see narrative change around Solana, whether it's new activities or the rise of DeFi and Solana or whatever it may be. We don't know. Right, there's so much innovation in this space, we have no idea what's coming next. And that's what makes the space so exciting. So anyway, Solana feels like it might be the epicenter, or at least part of it. So I'm really focused on that. Avalanche is also a contender. I don't think most people realize how Avalanche is building itself out, differentiating itself. Do you like Avalanche? Here the Avalanche founder explains how Avalanche is different. We have systems like Bitcoin, which are single asset, single chain systems. They do one job, they do it incredibly well. We have systems like Ethereum, which are multi-asset, but single chain systems. There's only one Ethereum. Systems like Avalanche are different. Not only is the consensus protocol much, much, much faster than everyone else's, because it uses something that nobody else is using, but it has a different architecture. Multi-asset, multi-chain. Yeah. Each and every one of the chains can be completely different 
congestion from the other. They're isolated from each other. Congestion on your chain does not impact me. High fees for you does not impact me. That allows us to be able to accommodate jurisdictional differences. If you want to have an American chain subject to American rules, we can have that. Avalanche is a latest generation blockchain and it has this architecture based on what we call subnets. Subnets are unique custom purpose, custom designed blockchains for a specific purpose. Cardano. Make sure you subscribe to our channel, Altcoin Daily, because we talk about the value prop of Cardano all the time. And other coins, of course. As long as Charles Hoskinson is involved in Cardano, I'm a believer. Cardano has never failed. That's a pretty remarkable thing when millions of people tried to break it and it lived through pandemics, staff changes, markets up, markets down, and everything in between. We're resilient. And that's because of the integrity of the process. We won't lose that. We're just going to make the process better every day and eventually conquer the world. So thank you all for listening. It's a pleasure to be here. It's good to be back. And we got some work to do. We're going for number one. Hey, join us at Bitcoin Amsterdam, October 12th and 13th. This is an epic Bitcoin conference. Use code altcoin daily, 10% off tickets. Get this ticket or get this ticket. Ticket prices increase as we get closer to the event. So many awesome speakers are being added every single day. Use code altcoin daily for 10% off. Hope to see you there. Hugely bullish on the Ethereum layer two space. In my opinion, Polygon, Arbitrum, and Optimism are the blue chips here. For Polygon, Starbucks, Reddit, Disney, Toyota, Nike, Instagram, all chose Polygon. Optimism, their ecosystem is vast. Even WorldCoin is choosing Optimism to build on. Arbitrum has a vast, vast ecosystem. If you're bullish on Ethereum, you ought to be bullish on Ethereum L2s. You tell me which ETH L2 is the best though. Next coin I want to include is BNB coin, mainly because I like CZ, I like Binance, and I like the way that they do business and run their exchange. I think if Binance exchange continues to do well, BNB will do well. So BNB coin is a bet on Binance. Do you think betting on Binance is a good bet? How would I manage a situation like the FTX collapse? Well, first of all, the key is not to get into that situation first. It's not just when a crisis happened, what do you do? When you move tens of billions of user funds and lost it, that's kind of hard to manage. But even when that happens, I think the best things to do is stop everything, be transparent, communicate, be open. But more importantly, the, key, the trick is not to even go anywhere near that. So there's a few principles in business that you never violate. Never touch user funds, keep them secure, keep them separate and run a healthy business, or run a sustainable business. Uh, don't take shortcuts. I think prevention is much, much more important than, uh, than handling it. But don't try to fool anyone again. If all Binance users want to withdraw their funds at the same time, will Binance go bankrupt? Uh, short answer is no. It will be completely fine. Uh, we have more than 100% reserves on every single coin um, that we hold uh, on behalf of our users. So feel free to withdraw at any time if you have any concerns. Uh, would be good. Final two, more of wildcard picks, Dogecoin because Elon Musk and Shiba Inu because people always want to find the next Dogecoin, a more affordable Dogecoin. Subscribe to the channel. We put out one video every day keeping you informed. See you tomorrow.